If you want to learn how to place your first trade on MetaTrader 5 platform, then you are watching the right video. I'll be showing you step by step how you can place your first trade and how you can modify the trades and close your order and also learn how to make money in the forex market with MetaTrader 5 platform. So let's go right in and we'll open the MetaTrader 5 app. This is the interface we see. Sometimes you may see the interface in advanced mode. So this is the advanced view mode. Either ways they are the same, just that this advanced view have more details showing you the lowest price for the day, the highest price for the day, the spread of the currency pair uh, or the instrument that is being traded, the current time of the broker at the moment, the appreciation or depreciation in the currency pair that is for the day, whether the currency has appreciated or depreciated, like this gold is telling us that gold has depreciated by 0.21% since today and for USD JPY is telling us that it has appreciated by 27% for today that is about 39.4 pips so that is just the detail that you're having in the advanced mode which the simple mode does not show you so this is the simple view mode. So going from the simple view mode, this first column is showing us the currency pair or this instrument being traded. The second column is showing us the bid price. And this last column is showing us the ask price. So the spread is always the difference between the ask and the bid. That is what gives you your spread and your spread is important. So if you do not know how to calculate it, you can always use the advanced view mode and it will show you automatically your spread. Like here in gold, your spread is just 1.1 pip. In Euro USD, your spread is 1.3 pip, which is this ask minus this bid. But always ensure that your trading currency that the spread is not very high. Okay, so that you don't spend much in placing a trade because your spread is the cost of your transaction. So let's say that I want to trade Euro USD. Okay, I want to place a trade on Euro USD. This is my Euro USD. The first thing I need to do is to get a chart of Euro USD to analyze. So I can click on Euro USD. I'll see this window that pops up. Then the next thing is that I will need to go to the charts to know what is happening in the chart, in Euro USD chart. So coming to Euro USD right away, I can see that the pair is in a downward trend right now. And I am comparing this with USD index, which is telling me or showing me the strength of the US dollar. So with this, I'll be able to know when the dollar is strengthening or when the dollar is weakening. So with this dollar index, I'm seeing that dollar is in an upward trend right away. So there is one cool feature of MetaTrader 5. You can compare two different instruments at the same time such that you can make a wiser decision. So right now I am comparing Euro USD and dollar index that is US index or DXY to help me ascertain the strength of the dollar when the dollar is strong, Euro USD will be depreciating. So I am expecting that with this upward trend in the dollar index, that Euro USD is going to fall the more, is going to depreciate the more down into this area. So that is just a hint. So based on that, I may place a trade to sell Euro at this point. And when I am placing the trade, my stop loss will be somewhere above this most recent high. And my take profit will be far right down. Down. So let me do exactly that. Okay, let's say my stop loss is going to be at this point 1.06328, which is about 60 pips. So my take profit will be two times of that. If I am going to risk 60 pips, then I am going to be targeting 120 pips and above. So there are two ways to place your trade on MetaTrader 5. You can either use the one click trading mode. This is the one click trading mode. When you click on it, it will bring out the sell and buy button. Then you can select the lot size that you want to trade. So here I can choose my lot size by using this arrow, uh, this up 
arrow and down arrow so if i want to trade a micro loss size i can use this to select the loss size i want or i can even type manually so you can even type the loss size you want manually so with this i can just type in where i want so when i have selected my lot size with this mode, you don't have provision to set your take profit or your stop loss at the moment. You just buy or sell, then you modify. So that is one way I will show you the two ways. I'm doing this on a demo account, so I will show you the two ways. When I click sell, it will ask me to accept the terms and condition for one click trading. Since I'm doing it for the first time, I will accept the terms and condition and click OK. So let's place the sell order right now. And I click on sell, immediately the sell order is activated. So right now we're having a sell of 0.1. So to modify the trade, come to this trade section of the app. This is the trade section and here is the trade. So what we need to do is we click on the trade to modify it come to modify position if you want to close the order you use this first one close order if you want to modify it you come to modify order we said earlier that we want the stop loss to be at 1.06289 so that is where we are leaving our stop loss at 60 pips and with that we are ready to lose about 60 dollars okay now now take profit is 1.04489 that is our target so we are targeting 120 pips while we are risking 60 pips so i can click ok so it's done now that is done when we click this we have our stop loss placed we have our take profit placed now that we've modified our order we can see the stop loss above here and the take profit is somewhere down so varies one way to place your order by using this one click trading mode the other way you can place your trade is by using this trading order button here so when i click on this it will show me sell limit so if i want to set a sell limit i can click on sell limit so i will use this arrow button here when I click on this arrow button to bring out this other platform, that is where I can now select my instant execution or any other type of order that I want. So in this place, I can now choose my lot size, then set my stop loss instantly. Let's say I'm still going for 60 pips. So I can set my stop loss at 1.06. 30 then my take profit at 1.0450 with this i've set my stop loss and my take profits instantly so i can now place my order so this is the second order here is it the stop loss is 1.030 zero and the take profit is 1.050 so this is how you can place your order on your metatrader 5 then if you want to place a pending order let's say that i want to place a sell limit i believe that this price is still going to go up a little before it starts coming down then i can still use this order button so when i click on it i will come to this arrow sign here and click on the arrow sign then it is already in sell limit then i will select my lot size select the price that i want to enter the market let's say i want to enter the market at 1.600 then my stop loss is 1.0630 a 30 pips stop loss then my take profit i must leave it at 1.0500 then if I want to set my expiration, maybe I may choose a time that I want this pending order to expire. By selecting today, what it means is that if this price did not get to 1.0600 the whole of today, then cancel this order. So I can select today and then place the order. So the order is placed. <clears throat> you can see the sell limit is right there. And the stop loss is above and the take profit is showing right here so that is how you can set your pending order your sell limit or your buy limit buy stop and your sell stop you can set them all right here from this other button and you can also place order on the second instrument that is right there in your chart 
in the second window so let's say for this i have clicked on this us index let's say that i want to put a buy limit okay i want to buy set a buy limit down here uh, maybe somewhere at this price so if i want to set buy limit at 1.105.88 i can still do the same by coming to this order so when i click on this order the buy limit option is showing right in the us index window not in the euro usd window so in that case i'll click this arrow then it will bring this out so i want to enter at 1.0580 for instance then stop loss is 1.05 uh, maybe 40 and my take profit is maybe 1.0700 so i may choose my expiration and sell, select a particular date so with that i can click my place so right now the buy limit is already placed here you can see the buy limit 0 0.1 stop loss is at this price and then your take profit is above so I have been able to place the trace on these two windows so that is how you place your order on metatrader 5. so like i promised that i was going to teach you how to make money in the forest market i'm going to close this order so that you will see that the profit is added to my account so to close the order each of them i will press on it then come to close order then i will close so this is done can see that the my balance has increased i'll do the same to this and close the other two so right now my orders are closed i don't have any other open position however i still have the pending orders which i placed till there here is my chart no other position is there the others have been closed it's showing that i have closed my orders both of them this and this have been closed i didn't allow it to get my take profit so here is my history the two orders have been closed and i've made 3.1 dollars so that is just how you can place your first trade on metatrader 5 and make money using the platform so you've just seen it everything was practically done and you can see that it is doable and if i can do it you can do it much more thank you for watching and i wish you a profitable trading journey so if you have enjoyed this video and you still want to learn more about metatrader 5 i want you to subscribe to my channel smash the like button and turn on the notification bell so that you don't miss out in any of my videos